Hi viewers, welcome to Element Solution. Today we are going to see about a bug and boost based grid connected PV inverter system in MATLAB. So this simulation model is developed based upon this following paper. So we refer this paper, a bug boost grid connected PV inverter for a mismatched environmental condition. So here you can see that this is the the circuit for that model dual bug boost based inverter and then you will see the the control logic here right so this is the control logic for that uh, the bug boost based grid connected pv system so here you will see that uh, uh, they are using mbpt algorithm and then it going to be processed via pa controller and then it will be generated a uh, power of uh, pv uh, that means here we have two PV, right? PV1, PV2. So, PV1, PV2, based on PV1, PV2, they are going to calculate uh, VC01 and VC02. And then, based upon that VC01, VC02, we are going to calculate uh, RPCON by using this formula. And then, so based upon that uh, RPCON and VCON. So the IL reference will be calculated in bug mode and boost mode, right? So when the VPN is greater than or equal to VCON, and then uh, it going to be act as in the bug mode, bug mode, and then VPN is less than VCN, then it going to be operated operate in boost mode. So the IL reference for a bug mode and a, the boost mode will be calculated based upon these equations. That means VCON divided by RPCON and V square CON divided by RPCON into VP, right? So, and then after we are getting IL reference, so that going to be compared with the uh, ILM and again going to be processed through a PA controller. And then the PA controller output will be considered as ANB and then based upon again we are going to check the condition vpn vcon if vpn is greater than or equal to vcon then uh, the duty cycle db equal to a and uh, dq equal to 0 otherwise the db equal to 1 and dq equal to 0 so based upon that we have to uh, generate the dp and dq okay so this is a control logic is implemented in this paper so same logic we are going to implement in the simulation model also so here you will see that uh, so better i can have so here you will see that the circuit diagram simulation diagram circuit diagram so you can compare this one right so here you can see that the, the pv is connected to the the dual bug boost converter so so pv and this portion known as uh, the dual bug boost converter and this portion is inverter and it going to be connected to the grid okay so next thing is uh, here for each PV side, right? We have to apply MPPT. So here we have first MPPT. So this MPPT will be generated and duty cycle or uh, PV yeah, okay. And then here you will see that, right? So MPPT one and, MP, and that means this is for a first PV panel and this is for a second PV panel. So this will be calculated duty cycle and duty cycle will be uh, multiplied with the voltage. So finally we will get the uh, V reference. So here we will get V reference. So this V reference will be compared with the VP1 and VP2. So PV panel voltage and the PV panel voltage 2. So this is first PV panel voltage. So this is second PV panel voltage and it will be processed via PA controller. Okay. So this PA controller is generating PPV1, PPV2. So this is based upon this control logic. So here you can see the common control logic. Okay. Then 
so here the pp1 is comes to here for calculating vc01 vc02 so here you can see that this is the circuit that means some link block for calculating vc not one vc not two okay so after calculating vc not one and vc not two so here we are going to uh, generate rpc not one and rpc not two so this implementation so this block implementation here okay so after that we have to go for a, a control logic for the bug mode and the logic so this one so here we are applying that uh, control logic uh, that means this control logic based upon bug mode you have to calculate the IL reference and based on boost mode you are going to calculate the IL reference and then again it going to be process via PA controller and then you have to apply this condition for selecting the duty cycle okay so this is a control logic is implemented here okay so this control logic so this control logic will be generated s1 and s2 so s1 s3 and s2 s4 right so this is going to be used to control this circuit okay so here you will see that right s1 s2 s3 s4 okay this is going to control this circuit and then here we need to control this inverter right s5 s7 s6 s8 right mean so we need to control that one okay so that will be controlled by based upon that pll concept right so so here you will see that right pl here right so based upon pll concept you have to control so why is it nothing but is uh, taken from here right that mean so here we are applying that pll right so based upon pll we are calculating y z so based upon y z we are switching that uh, s5 s8 and uh, s6 s7 okay so finally this pulse will be used to for control this inverter this inverter okay so this is a control logic for uh, controlling that con uh, converter right so this one so entire system will be used to for control this dual bug boost converter and this logic used to for control that uh, inverter okay and uh, here they are tested the model uh, the pv2 irradiation is fixed at some level so here i am going to fix uh, the P pv2 irradiation maintenance 1000 watts per meter square and then the pv1 irradiation will be changed by step varying condition right and then you have to check the results okay so here you will see that so here we are fix, fixing in the irradiation for pv2 is 1000 and here you can see that um, varying the irradiation of the pv1 one by one so it will be changed from 500 600 700 800 900 and then 1000 okay and then you have to check this results so first we have to check this result of uh, pp1 pp2 pp1 vp2 and the ip1 ip2 so i'm going to simulate this model So here you will see that results. So here in the figure six, right? This one. So here you can see that, right? So result of this uh, figure six. So this is this is PV one power. This is PV two power. So here you will see that, right? So this is a result of. Uh, that the blue color is PV2, red color will be PV1, and this is the blue color is PV2 and red color is PV1, right? So you will see that the same kind of pixel we are getting for changing irradiation condition, right? So next thing is you have to check the result of uh, grid current and the grid voltage, okay? So here you will see that that detail so this is a grid current and the grid voltage so here you will see that so 
so here you see that this is grid voltage and uh, grid voltage so grid voltage and current and then here you will see that pv power of uh, panel 1 panel 2 and pv voltage of panel 1 panel 2 and uh, current of panel 1 panel 2 so you will see you will get the similar kind of results okay and current also you are seeing right similar kind of result only current and voltage will be have similar kind of results so here we have to zoom it a little bit you, you will see that right uh, in phase current right both are grid voltage and current having in phase component okay so this is a result of the model as per that paper we have got that result so this is working of that uh, uh, DL bug booster based uh, grid connected PV inverter system so thanks for watching our videos kindly subscribe our channel and also click bell icon for bell icon for notification about upcoming videos thank you thank you so much bye bye